The Landmine Belt Squat, the best leg exercise to blow up your squats that you're not doing. Let's go. Hey guys, what's going on? Coach Frank here at the Critical Bench Compound. And in today's video, I'm gonna walk you through the Landmine Belt Squat, which in my opinion is probably the best exercise to improve your squat, to get stronger, to get bigger, powerful, faster legs. So I'm gonna walk you through the setup of this exercise and how you need to be doing and why, in my opinion, do I think it's probably the best exercise that you are not doing. Now, for those of you guys that are training at a commercial gym, chances are your gym probably has a landmine anchor. So just find that, find the landmine in your gym. Now, you've probably never seen this exercise before. You've probably used this setup before as a back exercise, maybe a V-bar row, maybe a landmine row, maybe a shoulder single arm press like we showed you in some of our other exercises. Today, I'm gonna to show you a little bit different of a type of exercise. But for those of you guys that don't have access to this anchor, here's how you can set one up at your home. Now, in order to get a landmine set up at home, all you need is a barbell, two walls, and a corner. Just take your barbell and take one end of it and drive it right into the apex of that corner. Now, yes, it's gonna scratch your paint. Yes, it may have a little bit of damage to the drywall, but guys, this is training. This is getting stronger. This is getting powerful. If you're using that room, that space for a gym, a little scratch, a little nick on the wall is gonna be okay. So once again, guys, all you need to set up a landmine at your home is a barbell, two walls, and a corner. Stick one end of the barbell into the corner. Back over here, guys. Before we get into today's exercise, guys, I just wanna remind you that 80% of your results 80% of what you're looking to get out of your training is not actually what you do in the gym. It's what your body consumes out of the gym. So as a gift from me to you today, what I wanna do is I wanna send you our brand new delicious anabolic protein smoothie recipe guide. And by clicking the link in the first pinned comment, I'm gonna send you the book, and I'm gonna send you one of our, our free, absolutely free Critical Bench Shaker Cups. So guys, inside of this, we got breakfast smoothies, we got lunch smoothies, we got pre-workout smoothies, post-workout smoothies. Guys, there's, 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 there's recipes that are high carb, recipes that are low carb, recipes that are high fat for those of you that are on the ketogenic diet. So remember, 80% of your results, 80% of your transformation is not what you're doing here in the gym, but what you consume out of the gym. So click the link down there, the first pinned comment, get your delicious anabolic proteins and your Critical Bank smoothie cup. Absolutely free. Back to the exercise, guys. So the landmine setup, as you can see, I have two weights here. The, the only purpose for these weights are to get me a little bit higher up off the ground so when I'm down at the bottom of the squat, I do not want this weight to touch the floor. So you're gonna need a belt like this. Pick one up, Amazon, Sports Authority, Dick, they all have it. For those of you guys that are crafty, I'm sure you can make one of these at your home. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna get this weight. I'm sorry, we're gonna get this belt wrapped around the weight. Now we want the chain as close to the as close to the top of the weight as possible. Now I'm gonna pick the weight up and help me guide it. Now guys, I do recommend you practice this exercise before you jump right in to whatever load you're gonna be using in your workout. And if you're doing this exercise to build strength, to build power, operating and, tr and working somewhere between that six to eight, 10 to 12, this is not really gonna be a conditioning type of movement. So no 15, no 20, no 25. Keep it lower reps, it is a power, power movement. But like I told you at the beginning of the video, guys, we're focused on building our strength, our power, and our legs without having to compress our spine, without having to put a lot of load and, and weight through our upper torso. So everything is here. I prefer a wider stance. You're gonna need this because of how this weight sits on your body. You just can't go super close. Your hips are not gonna be able to open up. So a little bit of a wider of a stance, feet and toes slightly pointed out. Now with our core, we're looking to stay upright. We don't wanna lean over, it's gonna pull us forward. So as we squat, we're gonna break at the knees and hip at the same time, keep our torso locked and engaged, solid upright. So all we're doing, squatting, Guys, you're really gonna feel this working through your hips, glutes, and hamstrings. Really driving that power through the back of those legs. Okay, guys, like I said, six to eight reps, feet slightly elevated, 
off the ground. Hey guys, so there you have it. The number one leg exercise that like I said at the beginning, I can guarantee you're probably not doing. Now, if you've done this before, if you've seen this before, comment below, let me know. Did I do a good job explaining it? Is it something that you're gonna try if this is your first time seeing it? I'd love to hear from you guys. Also, if you're new to the channel, tap that subscribe button so you're notified every single time we leave or release a new video and hit the thumbs up. Did you get value out of today's video, guys? I need to know so I can continue to provide you with these incredible exercise videos. And just like I said at the beginning of the video, guys, 80% of what you're gonna get out of the gym, 80% of what you get out of your exercises is gonna be dictated by what you consume out of it. So if you haven't done so yet, tap that first link in the comment there below. Delicious anabolic protein shakes and smoothies and a free critical bench shaker cup, free on me. I'll see you guys in the next video.